I just wanna live my life. Christmas, my Christmas, my vibe, my vibe. Was welcome to Chorus Kitchen. It's Chorus Kitchen. Was was. If you are just joining me, welcome to my kitchen, number one home to delicious cuisines from all around the globe. Today, I'm gonna be making some yummy, delicious tilapia fish. This is exceptionally yummy. And it's something I like to spoil myself with when, you know, you know, maybe I'm feeling a little down or whatever. I just get in my freezer, throw out one of my tilapia fishes and make a delicacy. Join me as we bake this delicious fish. Don't forget to click on my link and enjoy my beautiful song Cruise by Cora Obidi out right now um boy hit me with the fire thing why you wrote me like a roman thing oh first of all the first thing we're gonna do for this delicious tilapia fish is to do what make the spice rub ah yes the spice rub is super important for fish. To make the spice rub, you're gonna be needing gonna be needing this extra virgin olive oil and all the spices you can you can rub on this delicious fish. Let's see. And for this fish, I don't have to, thank God, be very careful with my spices because guess who's not home? Nobody to say, it's too so spicy, mommy. <laughs> Who says that? <laughs> okay, so this fish is going to be a spicy tilapia cook, okay? Let's get to it. I'm going to be eating it with some yummy fried plantains air fried plantain that I'm also going to use the spice rub to make. We start by, what should we start by, with? Making the spice rub or making the, okay, let's just make the spice rub. In this plate, we're going to add a generous amount of olive oil. Yes, this is how I make my own. This is how I make my own, okay? And then we're gonna open, open sesame, all the spices. Call the spices out one by one if you do not know how to make this fish come get in here because i'm teaching it today for free okay see this Cube, seasoning cube I'm gonna use for my fish. This is the seasoning cube I choose to use for my fish. We've never had plantains before, wow honey anyway i'm melting the cubes in the oil how can you live without plantains plantain is life <laughs> plantain is life baby inside my oil i'm putting my seasoning cube my seasoning cube into the oil 
because this is what I'm going to use to rub all of the fish. Putting my rainbow peppercorns. I'm going to be generous with my black pepper. Some ground paprika. Lemon pepper seasoning. Lemon pepper seasoning has a citrusy flavor that really goes well with fish. My curry. And I'm going to get my thyme. Thyme goes in there. Curry thyme. What is left? Garlic and ginger. So, I was taught by my sister to always make my garlic and ginger paste. Unfortunately, recently I've been very, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe what would the word? What would the word be? Aloof, I guess aloof about the things that i need to do but it's okay i'm giving myself space to feel this way and let it pass you know i have not made any garlic and ginger paste in a hot minute and so i'm gonna quickly make some now this is the spice rub for the fish I'm going to make a garlic and ginger paste, which is just basically blending garlic and ginger. And you can put the remaining in your fridge and store it up for whenever you have to cook. Fresh garlic and ginger is just better than the powdered ones. This garlic is so <laughs> begging for mercy. We love tilapia, easily deep fried and crispy. You know, make matoki, mash plantains with peanut sauce mm. my mouth is watering without description baby wow african food is delicious if you've not tried african food honey if you've not tried some plantain, some tilapia, some yummy, yummy Nigerian or Ghanaian or Cameroonian, African Sierra Leonean, whatever African food, you're missing out. my chef's knife because it's too big for you you don't like seeing me use it
You might wonder why I'm taking so much time to make this ginger. Ginger as an herb takes the fish to another level. You know, it takes it to another level. making the ginger and the garlic Somebody looking at me with an evil eye. Are you looking at me with an evil eye? Yeah, chopping garlic is <laughs> one of the worst things I hate to do while I'm cooking. That's why it's always best for you to make a lot of garlic and just blend everything. So you just have a paste you can just go to. It's a kitchen hack, but I haven't done that in a long time. So I'm just chopping up the garlic. Today I am going to have dinner with my LA parents. <gasps> I'm looking forward to it because, oh my gosh, my LA parents are bougie. <laughs> oh my God, I'm excited. Um, I'm excited to have dinner with my LA mom, my LA dad. Um, it's gonna be an amazing time. And as you guys all know, the Independence Day of my country, Nigeria, is tomorrow. We're going to be celebrating the Independence Day, even if the country is not in its greatest shape. We're looking forward to the future in hopes that things will be better and we can never give up on ourselves. And I love Nigeria. Oh, it does smell good with the garlic and ginger, trust me. It smells amazing in my kitchen already. We're gonna make sure this tilapia is to die for. Thank you so much for 100 stars. Love you, appreciate you. Love you, appreciate you for all your support. Uh,
gonna season this fish and we're gonna eat it made with love made with love so i'm just running the knife up and down it, it gives it a nice chop thank you jacqueline chalmon daily thank you so much for 500 stars love you cora sing happy birthday to my nine-year-old i can do that for your nine-year-old but next time if you want me to do anything you know what to do <laughs> happy birthday to you happy birthday to you happy birthday dear nine-year-old happy birthday to you you That's what you get when I've not done any vocal exercises in the morning, eh? You get. <laughs> That's what you get, baby. What you see is what you get, get, get. Ayy. Okay, so look at all this ginger and all this garlic. I'm going to chop my onion. Yeah, I'm going to chop my onion. Thank you. Connecticut, wow. Love you. Thank you for watching me. Tell your friends and family. I wanted to tell you guys something. Thank you for 1,950 stars. Love you. Thank you, Chanel Williams, for 400 stars. Love you. I wanted to tell you guys something. Guys. Guys. I don't know if I should tell you guys this. I probably shouldn't. No, no, I'll just save it. I'll just save it. I'll just save it. Christine William Crossland for 500 stars. Love you.
making tilapia fish look it's gonna be spicy i'm gonna have to fix my my freezer i have too many things in there I cannot get the best of me. Okay. Then chop up the chilies. <laughs> you guys are watching me fight with my freezer. Mm, I moved from a sparkling stainless steel freezer that had more space that I could use to this one I fight with every day when I add any new thing. Fish is gonna be spicy. Oh my god. Yay! Are you ready for us to season this fish? I can already taste the spiciness of the fish. It's called Rest Kitchen. Was, 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 was. <laughs> this is going in here. Ah, my do gone. Yay! Yay! Look, look at that. And we're gonna add a little bit, a little bit, a little bit of more oil, you know. Mm. Then I'm going to take my. I 
remember somebody bought me this thing that I used to rub it on the on the fish. And now I can't find it. Jesus is Lord. Jesus, you love me too much. Okay, let's concentrate on this fish. This fish needs to be seasoned. Okay, so I'm going to use a regular spoon since I cannot find my basting equipment. Hmm. Ebo now. Ebo. Ah ah. Ebo. <laughs> Yay. It's going to be nice. Mmm. I can smell the olive oil. The fish needs more cleaning. I've really, really cleaned this fish before I brought it out here. Okay, don't worry about it. Okay. Don't worry about it, sweetheart. Don't worry about it. <laughs> your five-year-old is screaming, no, please don't eat the fish. Show your five-year-old this right now. <laughs> oh, you're gonna traumatize your five-year-old. Like for example now, just right now, like now, like what happened right now is I'm looking for my foil. If I can't find my foil, there will be no baking of no fish. Oh my God. Do I not have any foil? I knew it. I knew it was hiding up there. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shh. Shh. Shut up your mouth. Shut up before you say anything nonsense there. Shut up. If I didn't climb, I would have not found my foil. So shut up. Nonsense. How do you guys deal with me? How do you deal with me? I know you love me, XOXO. <laughs> Boy, hit me with the fire, I sing. Boy, you run me like a room, I run my team. show you my secret weapon in this fish <laughs> I told you to share up Shh. it's 
is my secret for fun. Anytime you see this black nylon, nylon bag, just know Nigeria today is Nigeria. I'm going, I'm scared for the pepper to go inside your nyash. Don't worry about it, sweetheart. Don't worry about it. Okay? Don't worry about it, sweetheart. This black nylon symbolizes Nigeria. Hallelujah. About a gold zing. This is how we do it. Yeah. Whew. Yeah. This is how we do it. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah. You know what's inside here? Suya Yaji. What do you know about Suya Yaji? What do you know about my Malan Suya Yaji? Your local Malan can prepare this for you. It's a secret weapon in your kitchen. Just watch how I transform this fish with my my American no Nigerian ones. Hey, hey! Shout out to my Hawaji, aka my Nancy Obidi, Nancy Ume. My Suya Yaji she brought from Nigeria for me. I'm just gonna add a little bit, or not? Yay! It's giving. Main karatsa fish. Like, have you seen my lip? Hey! I've, I've messed up the song. That bag is not nylon, it is plastic. What do you know about nylon bag? Shut up! What do you know? Kill them all. What do you know? What do you know about nylon bag? I say, shut up your mouth. This is nylon. Give me nylon. Black nylon. You say not plastic. Olodo. Olodo one kobo. Oh, thank the Nigerian for translation. Shio. We're going to mix the yaji. We're going to mix it. We're going to mix it. Look at Yeah. That's what we call nylon. Leave it for us. Leave it for us. It's what we call nylon bag. I'm just gonna taste this for the road, okay? So kalika pins the fish in a so kalika moi moi. It ain't make your mouth in a bit the fish in a so kalika moi moi. I'm just gonna add one for the road. Where is it? One more for the road. Sakali kape. Dirty feet on the counters. I saw, I said it. That's why I told you to share up before I climb this counter. Because I know you are going to come out of your shell. <sighs> Look at that. Look at that. Dirty feet on the counter. I know. That's why I silenced you before I did it. Nonsense. Sure. Please. Eat my Melanin popping nyash. Nonsense. Don't forget to give the fish some incisions. Yes, mama, I will. I will. Thank you for the tips. We're going to cook this fish to perfection, baby. <laughs> Tilapia is a fish that should not be consumed it is not an ocean you say what mm 
I did not rip that one well properly. Sorry. My lawn is like satin. Auntie, go and sleep. Go and sleep, please. You need sleep. You need sleep. You look like you are, you are, you are needing sleep. You are sleep deprived. If you say nylon is like satin, that's your own business. It's your own cup of tea. That's nylon for me. You like it, you don't like it. Kelelem, kelelem, I don't care. Okay, so this one is ready now. International Peri Peri. Okay, we're gonna do some justice to this tilapia. We pray for this spirit of this tilapia. Thank you for dying to feed Cora's belly today. I promise you, I will do three twerking on your name and three bosa for this tilapia for feeding me today. Bosa, bosa, bosa. Put a bra on. Have respect, girl. <laughs> respect for who you? No, baby. In fact, let me show you my lack of respect. Let me show you a little bit of res the, the rude girl behavior. Baby, <laughs> you shall never come out of my block list. You are forever and ever and ever and ever blockery blue, blue, blue. Yeah, I said what I said. Usually I don't do this, but you know, because I'm watching with a lot of people, I'm just gonna take off this fins. Me, I will keep the fins on and I will eat it. And I will swallow the fins. I will suck the fins. Yes, the fins give makes my teeth white and strong. But because I'm watching with some people that'll be like, oh my god, they just eat the fins. Okay, so we're gonna put the incisions and the fish right now. One for Nigeria. One for Nigeria. Two for Zimbabwe. Three for my South African husband, who is Zulu, by the way. Four for my American followers. And one on the side for my for my Manila Manila followers. I love Manila Manila Manila. See, I've already cleaned this fish. Look, I already opened here like this, right? I'm going to put all my konyomi inside here. Are you ready with me? Are you ready to season this fish with me? It's called Rust Kitchen. I can call Rust Kitchen. Was 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 kitchen was was aye okay we're gonna open this up nice and nicely we're gonna stuff some in there yeah we're gonna smear it around with love eh whoa Yeah, we're gonna season and pamper it. Mm. Make sure you put it in the crevices of the incisions. Yeah. Mm. Sakalika beans. Hey, asuna sakalika mai mai. Oni miku mahati de jum jum. Ama sakalika mai mai. about spicy fish a little bit of plantain and spicy fish yeah 
a little bit of this, a little bit of that, a little bit of pantin and spicy fish. Give me that sweet eat for real. For real, give me the sweets now. Where's my? <laughs> Did I just chase my tail? <laughs> Roll it. Control it. Roll it. Girl, I like the way you roll it. Mmm. Control it. I like it. Mmm. In Cabo, what? How do I call them? This is what they call them. This is what they call what? Them. This is what they call enjoyment to the max. This is what they call enjoyment pro max. This is what they call Demosiao. Okay, we're gonna make sure we shove it in there. Shove it all up. Shove it. Shove it in there. Shove it in there. Yeah. Shove it. Is that a little bit too. Oh, I'm sorry. Is that a little too raunchy? Oh my god. Okay, we're gonna make sure that we shove the fish with the spices like this nicely and smear it around and just you know, yeah. Nonsense, an ingredient. You're gonna shove it in the fish. You're gonna do what? You're gonna make a hole. You're gonna stick it in there. You're gonna stick it. You're gonna shove it. You're gonna shove it inside the fish. You're gonna shove it. Yeah. You're gonna what? Shove it. For all of you that don't put what? You don't put anything on your fish. You don't put any spice. You just put salt. You are idiots. You are a what? <laughs> you are a goat. Make sure you put some spice on your fish today. Okay? For your mental health. Yeah. Give me the fish in some incision. Give the fish some incision. I already gave the fish some incision. Ah, ah, all of you incision surgeons. All of you lipo doctors. Incision surgeons. Tell me to incise. Circumcise my fish. I already gave it incisions, baby. I think that you were just fantasizing about like incision or whatever. Like, I already did that. Okay, like. Yeah. Take note, this is a radiance cookware pan. It's not even a pan, it's the cover of the pan. But you see, it's a multi-talented, you know, something. I can use it for the baking of the fish, but I'm not gonna use it. But I can if I want it, but I'm not gonna do it. But if I wanna really, really want it, I could have done it, but I'm not gonna do it, you know? But yeah, that's what I mean, you know? Like, yum. Make sure you don't waste anything because this fish deserves the best. So we're gonna make sure that we cover this fish with the foil. Sweet, for real. Sweet, Angelica, yeah. this now what uh -uh. so nice and juicy package of goodness it's an amazing package this is how they serve it to you they cut it open and you eat your no your noble fish yeah okay so we're gonna turn on the oven to 350 and then Using my Radiance Cookware Grill Pan. It's not like a, it's just going to place it there. Just as a balance in the oven, yeah. 
So we say butter, butter. Mm -mm, we don't use that here. Over here, we don't use butter and lemon. This one is African fish, okay? If you want to use butter and lemon, go and buy salmon fish. This one is Nigerian tilapia fish. Yeah. We're gonna leave that there until we are tired. No, technically we're gonna leave there for like uh, 40 minutes. Timer. Timer goes. 45. It's time for us to do what? Continue with our cooking. The fish is doing its thing. The fish is doing its what? Its thing. Yeah. The fish is doing its what? It's fine. <sighs> We're gonna start. Don't judge me. You judge me, God will judge you. You judge me, God will judge you. Nonsense. I was thinking about it. Some people might be judging me now because my counter is not clean. If you judge me, God will judge you. Yeah. Okay. scratcher for sure like she disgusting oh my goodness she opened a plantain and put it in her mouth dang holy mm -mm -mm. i'll pass i'll pass thank you judge me i know what is going on in your heads Ju judge me nonsense Yeah, this one never ripe. Oh. This one is not ripe yet, but I already opened it, so. Oh no. Should have waited a couple of days. Should have waited a couple of days. Should have waited a couple of days before I open up the plantain. Now it's not ripe. Oh no. Music in Spotify, the plantain is not ripe by Cora Obidi. Yeah. <laughs> I should have waited a couple of days. Hmm, should have waited a couple of days. Should have waited a couple of days. <sighs> okay. Dying. You're not ripe, not ripe. Like, you're giving me a hard ass time. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. you like, fine. Ah, ah. Dang, bro. Whew. I know this plantain is not going to be sweet. It's not going to be sweet. I never be sweet. A sweet plantain is not it's not hard. It applies to plantains and applies to women. <laughs> I did not say anything. 
it's you know hmm did Cora just say that the planting that is hard is the same as women who are hard? Like when you are hard, you cannot be sweet. That is crazy. I told you. Should have waited a couple of days. Should have waited a couple of days. Should have waited a couple of days. Not a planting is not a right. I'm going to wash my hands because some people will not have a heart attack. Yeah, I wash my hands, okay? Cause I already know your 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 heads. You're already saying holy mother. Oh my god. She just took that plantain, caught it all up, and did not wash her hands. I'm telling you, take that girl back. Return her back. Return her back. Cause she a monkey monkey. It's just hard. <laughs> Why? I think I'll use some paprika just to put some seasoning on my plantain or whatever, you know. Thank you. Where's my Oil. We're gonna put this in the air fryer. You know, put in the air fryer. wishing you were gonna eat this with me right next to me and then give me a small tap on my butt pop, and say Cory you're so silly I'm sure you wish but no you can only eat it with me I need to show you guys how I'm putting you guys know how to put something in the air fryer right I don't need to show you how I put it in the air fryer like that's like no, like you guys already know. Do you know? I'm just gonna assume that you do. Okay? Let's assume that you do. Set it at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for 10 minutes. Let's see what that looks like, even if the planting wasn't ripe. Because I should have waited a couple of days. Was, was. That was a little bit too, like, I didn't think it was gonna jump up like that. When I did it, I did not, if I'm being honest, I didn't intend for it to jump up like that. You get me? Yeah, like, that was not intentional. Okay. Yeah, so it's not like I was trying to twerk or anything. Like, I just wanted to do like just one pop and it just like, I was not even trying, you know, just to put it out there. Yeah. I should have waited a couple of days. So both my things, 
my fish is in the oven my plantains are in the air fryer I could have put it in the oven as well but the air fryer gives it a better crisp in my opinion I love you guys. You guys should stay with me. I cook with you. You guys, uh, if you keep up with this, I might never get married again. You know, like you need to like, because you know, like this is like so much love. Like it's a lot of love. Mm hmm. Okay, so I am done. Absolutely done. It took us how many minutes? If you want to go back to see how long this took us, all you have to do is check the timing on this live video. And I believe it's going to be an amazing meal. And we're going to eat it together in the next live video scheduled to be in about 40 to 30 to 50 minutes. So stay tuned. Cause we clean up, clean up, we've all had fun today. Now it's time to clean up and put everything away. Yay! Clean up, clean up, we've all had fun today. Now it's time to clean up and put everything away. Somebody, I miss. Oh well. Ah. Hey there. I think Cora suffers from ADHD. The way she can't stay still shows that. Your, your, your generation, they are the ones suffering from that, okay? You and your entire generation will suffer from that. Amen and amen. I don't know why all of you will be diagnosing people. People, when you don't even know yourself. Nonsense and ingredient cow. I've never had ADHD, I will never have. I was an A student. No, no, no nonsense diagnosis that your, your mother gave you. You are trying to project on me. Nonsense cow goats. Any small thing you will be diagnosing people and giving them different, different name of disease. Cow. Meh, goats, malu. I am in healthy shape. I know it's hard for you to understand that somebody can just be there without any disease because you are used to all your life everybody has disease me I don't have okay please do not put your disease and your family disease on me 
Thank you and God bless. Cora, a lot of fake pages online with your picture of you and your children. It's okay, guys. They are working for me. There's something called a rights manager. So if they take any of my copyrighted um, things, Facebook sometimes um, tells them to take it down. Or if they don't, then Facebook will monetize it. But will um, find a way to make sure that the monetization is split in half between me and them. So it's okay. Okay? Thank you, love. Yes, they'll just be coming outside and be telling you different different things that you are. Cora, I think you suffer from you are you and your family are suffering from it. Nonsense, cow goats. Can you blow my whistle? Was was. Let me know, girl, I'm gonna show you what's what's. Hey, that's why, ha. Huh? Mm. Please, if I got a dollar for every time some disgusting, shriveled looking, raisin looking face told me that's the reason why my, my ex left me, I think I, by now, me and June and Athena will have our own house. Please. All your reasons and speculation of why they left me nine days postpartum is your business. It's not my business. You say it here, you are blocked. You are what? Flat blocked and deleted. I didn't mean for my girls to be angry like that, but it is what it is. You say it here and you are blocked. Nonsense cow girls. You can have your speculation, it's fine. Me too, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. When I was married, yeah, I was inside that I was inside, I was one of those women shamefully analyzing why eh, some people might have divorced because in my head I was omini know it until it happened to me. You understand? So share up. Share up. Yes, I've been married and now I am single. And I I can tell you, I know different types of I, I, analy analysis in your head yeah so if you're here analyzing you can keep it in your head ah that's the reason why they left her oh that's the reason why you can analyze your brain is your brain you can do whatever you like with your brain but if you say it here you are gonna get you're not gonna even see me to analyze again you're not gonna see me you are gonna look for me you're not gonna see me you can analyze money tonight evening and night but if you want to analyze and you say it you're not gonna see me to analyze nonsense and ingredients you are always right there with her so you know you wake up with the camera in your face it's not what some people pray for and i'm living my dream and you are you are here angry with me nonsense I know I can never please you. <laughs> we can never please you, and that's okay. I just wanna live my life, cruise my cruise, and vibe my vibe. Are you angry? Do me a favor, please. Stream my new music. It's called Cruise by Cora Beatty. Long. do you always have mm -mm. <sighs> I just want to thank God today for my Koreans I am nothing without my Koreans my Koreans are everything I love you guys so much ah even somebody says something that ah on Jamilaraja ah when I really did do my nyash like this yeah how are you gonna say that to me but before I even go and talk my Koreans have knocked you what's so what's so left right and center they've gone to your profile they've screenshotted your big head that Apollo head they've put it there they've insulted you and this right here this sloppy kiss is for my Koreans I just want to say I love you mama loves you one day I'm gonna come to your city I'm gonna French kiss your forehead if there's no COVID I'm going to love on you I'm gonna hug you because I love you, okay? Thank you. Thank you so much. 
it is sweet to me like love. So when it is go, go sweet to my what? I should do the thing. Wow. Now we're gonna make a nice side sauce because I'm telling you for free right now, yeah. I'm telling you, fish is not nice if you don't have a nice side of tomato sauce to balance it. Balanciego, okay. Thank you, love you, my Ami, my Kora Ami, the Koreans. I swear to you, if you see a Korean, just know that person is a good person. If someone tells you I'm a fan of Kora, just know that person is a good human being. Yes, because they do overtime work to protect me. They do overtime, oh, overtime. Because these, these people, hmm. No, 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 no. This girl is on fire. Thank you, Charmaine Millington. Oh, thank you, Charmaine. This is the second time you're sending me stars today. Love you. Appreciate you, Mil Charmaine. This girl is on fire. She's walking on fire. Anniversary follower seeing this now you are now blocked. You know what an anniversary follower is? Someone who has been following you for a whole more than two to three years. Hey, that's a full relationship. We are in a relationship. We are caught, we are dating, and you come here and you abuse me. That's an abusive relationship. Yeah, and so. We're gonna just have to break up, you know, like you you we can't work, you know, like how can you be an anniversary follower and you abuse me? No, if you're a new follower, I can tolerate you a little bit. Maybe you don't know me. But where yeah, you are seeing I'm seeing anniversary follower on your name. It means we are dating. We are dating and you are insulting me. <laughs> Jesu Olore. It's blocked because I can't take such abuse. Back in the day, I was a doormat. Not anymore.
told you I get in a trance when I'm cooking. It's almost like therapeutic for me. All this food for you alone. My sister. Allow me to enjoy myself. Allow me to enjoy beer. Allow me to enjoy myself. Now be making Jesus. Wow. Okay, I'm gonna go off and I'm gonna show you guys how I'm gonna make this delicious sauce to accompany my fish. Clean your elbow, Cora is dead. Bullet fat boy handsome Adams. Wow. Blocked. Okay, love you. Mwah. See you soon. I'm gonna show you how to make this delicious sauce.